paying to park in the capital city. No more warnings with the new parking permit system in Albany. You'll be ticketed if you park for more than two hours during the day in the Tenbrook Mansion or Center Square neighborhoods in Albany. Matt Markham walked with a parking enforcement officer to see how many people complied on day one. Mindy Perez is on the lookout walking her Chestnut Street beat. We have to time everything first then come back in two hours and see if everyone follows the rules. The first day of permit parking in the Center Square neighborhood, most drivers are compliant with their permits displayed, but... I marked the tires at 10 o'clock, came back, got them at 12.02. The first offender gets a $65 ticket. There had been a month-long grace period. How many warnings do you think you've issued? Oh, my goodness. Um, I honestly cannot even tell you. If the neighborhood is concerned about state workers, they should have less reason to be. The Office of General Services is telling me that a thousand extra spots have been made available for state workers. 900 have applied for them. We chat with some of the people that park on the street, and they have paid parking someplace, except that it's this our street is closer to where they work. Blocks from the Empire State Plaza. Some offices have been moved back here, bringing more employees and more cars. However, during the workday, it appears to us that there are lots of spots for those who paid the $25 yearly price. I think that's reasonable, but I think having the permit system is, uh, is something that we need down here, and it seems to be working really well. But I think this might be another ticket. The signage says it. Two-hour parking, 8 to 6. The city has sold 3,300 of these permits. Matt Markham, CBS 6 News.